story, y'all. This is like a lot of people in the hood where Jit really like got us out of the mud. It kept us busy, yeah, it kept us look like, it, it's one of those things, since it's so much into it, it keeps you focused. And like Red says, it makes you not want to stop. So you, you looking at the next person and you're like, I want to get better than him. I want to get better. I want to get better. I'm going to beat him next time. It's a very passionate dance, but it's also, it's a dance that makes you, it's a, it's a, it's a gritty dance. So when somebody beats you, you get a feeling that makes you want to work hard because you want to come after them. So I had this guy here teaching me, showing up in my school, beating me, killing me, killing everybody from unseen. Mr. Grandmaster Lee, so talk to me. Just, you know, just give me a little, you know, this question is more of a, just like you've been in the game for a long time and I would love to just have you share, you know, the progression of like your experiences with it and what it's done for you. Well, where do I start? It's been a long time. A long time. <laughs> Jen for about, I want to say 30 years. 30 years. Don't say the number. Man, I have to. Yeah. It's been a long time, but when I started, what made me get into it was this guy named Bisco Joe battling uh, one of my mentors at the time named Stone. Man, that was an epic battle. And I was just, I was a breaker. I didn't really know too much about it. I seen it, my cousin did it. I tried it, it was horrible, horrible. But when you keep trying, you end up picking it up. It's pretty easy, but what's, it, it's pretty much just, man, it's so much I can say because I've been in this for so long. It changed my life all the way around. You got time. Hey. I you. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I started jitting, it was, it was a, a hood thing. It was me and my homies. We was on the street. We on the block doing it on the corner, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to say what we was doing on the corner. I'm going to keep that under wraps, but we was on the corner playing loud music. Grandma telling us to get in the house, you know? And we used to end up getting in a lot of trouble being out in the streets. So when I decided to join a group, that started keeping me out the streets. So I was actually jet before I joined the group. And it was more of a street dance. We would be on the block doing knucklehead stuff at the same time having fun. But, and when I got into JIT and started getting into groups, that's when that just started to change my life because I started to incorporate other people and started to dedicate myself to it. That way I wouldn't have other distractions like smoking weed, drinking. And I would still go to parties because that's where the JIT was, you know? Like he said, the Grand Cortis, that was my home base. And uh, I started at the dancery, man. I love that the place. The dancery. <laughs> man, Friday night, the dancery come on the radio. I was, what, 15? When they old enough to get in there, my homeboy knew the bouncer named Big Meech, R.I.P. Big Meech. He up in heaven right now, the ghost dancers. Yeah, man. I love this crap. I wouldn't be nowhere without it. And I'm glad he, where he at? My cousin, I'm glad you're keeping it going, man. Keep teaching the kids. Keep doing what you're doing, man. Love you for that. And Lamar, I'm going to bust your ass. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, that's, that's my little bro. You know, I got to be on my keep him on his toes. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's pretty much it, man. I love this craft. I learned how to bug from watching adversaries. You know what I'm saying? Go at it. And that's what make, that's what make me better. I said, I look at people and I, just like he said, I want to be better than him. You know what I'm saying? He, he's one of the coldest guys I've ever seen. I, and people want to say, like, it's all about the competition. When really the competition, it's more like a brotherhood. Because you want to see that other guy dance. You, they be like, you want to battle? You want to battle? Y'all really don't care. You will. You was pulling him out in the circle because you, 
you wanted to see him dance. You you his, you, you not only his op, you his biggest fan. Wow. So yeah. <laughs> that that's just pretty much it. I don't got much to say. I'm ready to bug. <laughs> <laughs>